welcome back to Dead Space. The main mission is to power up the asteroid defense system, but I want to focus on the side missions for now, though you are not authorized, because I want to get the master security override. First one I'm going to do is try to find Volker's rig in the hangar. On the way to the hangar, we now have security access too, so we can also open this for the first time. Bridge, hall, storage. Clearance confirmed. Oh, I see a lot of shiny things. I desperately need this because we just had that just had that boss fight that took up most of my ammo. Ah, oh, okay, so it seems like Volker's rig is um, over here, just outside the hangar bay. I actually had to go through engineering and basically come up this shaft that we originally went down. Yeah, because I didn't explore out here. Once I once I came out here, past the uh, like force field, I just went straight for the shaft. It seems like Volker is over here. Yeah, that green thing. So I guess I probably could have found it before. There it is. Oh, hello. Oh, healing, thank god. Alright, the one for Chief Engineer Rousseau uh, cannot be gotten at the moment because I need security clearance 3 and I only have clearance 2. This one might be possible. First Officer White's rig. Uh, it says, for some reason they're outside the ship in the ADS cannon trench off the bridge deck. Don't know if that's accessible, but apparently it's up here. This elevator in the um, atrium that goes to water purification and exterior hole. Let's try it. This is not where we need to go for the main quest. That's the other elevator, just on the other side. looking for you, but it is completely fucked. I'm not sticking around in case whatever did it comes back, and neither should you. It looks like the admin staff went to the mining deck to meet up with the other survivors. I'll head there too. If you aren't with them, I'll find a way to contact you. I promise. Why so much loot? I don't like that. Purification or ADS cannons. Wait, is this part of the main quest? And do I want to turn off water purification? I mean, do I need water purification? Power transferred from water purification to ADS. 
Well, now I can't turn it off, so it's probably fine. Power from water purification's been rerouted. Must have tripped something. All the access doors just sealed. Works for me. God knows what's floating around down there. That's one. We still need more power. A couple more systems should do it. Okay, so that was part of the main mission. Oh my god. The lighting in here is intense. Intermediate engineer rig. That's going to be the next level of suit, right? Hell yeah. So do I need to go through there? And I can't. Okay, so we can't do the side mission anymore. Let's head up to the admin systems and comms array. I can choose from multiple floors. Looks like our objective is on floor two. Yeah, admin's the current one. Oh, this thing doesn't work in a vacuum, does it? Yeah, that makes sense. That's a really cool detail. And then everything gets sucked out. Exiting vacuum. Entering vacuum. Isaac, I'm reading electrical hazards on the floor ahead of you. 60-year-old dead plane doesn't play well with power surges. Watch your step. Clearance confirmed. Is this a new weapon? Contact beam. That's a big freaking gun. Heavy duty energy projector. Sounds like it's like a heavy version of the uh, pistol thing we had before. I already forgot the name of it. The special is Asteroid Cutter. Damn. Heavy energy projector that launches a continuous lethal beam. Okay, let's try shooting it. That's satisfying. 
Hell yeah. Well, I bet this thing is just gonna laser off limbs. Pretty effective. Okay, let's not touch that. What is that powering? Just this light? I don't know what that just did. Tracking infection. Mining administration log. And Thibid Thibidu? <laughs> I don't think I'm pronouncing that right. Admin support officer. Trying to work out how fast they spread. The flight deck was the first to go, probably thanks to that shuttle crash. Most of medical is overrun and losing ground by the hour. Engineering can't be far behind. No word from cargo or communications, so not expecting anything but bad news when we do. Our best hope seems to be the mining deck. Dallas says the infrastructure down there is still running. But if they took out security that fast, how long can we hold out? Really low on health. I didn't know they even would melee attack you at all.
mining or ADS cannons. Yeah, I think we can stop mining. Just got nothing. Power diverted from mining administration network. That's two. One more system and we'll have power for the ADS. Oh no. Come back here, you piece of shit. Don't turn any bodies. Floor three now. Ooh, I'm so glossy. Freshly waxed. The fuck? long hallway of doom. <laughs> oh, <laughs> all right. A recording? Huh. Must be the marker they dug up. So it is the same. That marker, that's the symbol of the Church of Unitology. It didn't take you for a believer, Isaac. My mother was. But if they found this on some alien planet, what does that mean? That Unitology's onto something? Unitology's full of shit. Forget it. Unitology article. United we ascend? Is Unitology a new hope, or just another scam? By Carrie Van Otken. If you've been living on Mars for the past 200 years, you might have missed the fastest growing religious movement in history. Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEOs and officials in its ranks, claims 78 billion of stock in multi-global companies, and owns two of Earth's largest financial institutions. From its beginnings as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected, established religion. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, a respected geophysicist, blew the whistle on what he claimed to be the biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government. The discovery of an artifact, or marker, which proved beyond any doubt there is alien life in the universe. The government labeled Altman a kook, but his claim struck a chord with some, and his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest, along with civil unrest and demand for action. Unitologists believe the marker contained a code 
the key to eternal life through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. They say the government is hiding the marker somewhere, keeping its secrets for themselves. Across all of human space, unitologists praise Altman's martyrdom and await the day God comes to take them to their new life beyond death. It all sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of its critics believe there are at least three ranks above the average believer, or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner workings and research is revealed to a follower. And these ranks are achieved by one simple criteria, giving money and power to the church. Think taking all your money's bad? The church also requires their members to donate their bodies after death. Why? What do they do with them? Nobody will say, and attempts to infiltrate the inner circle have failed. With their emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe we wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumor that also refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding program. Some claim to have seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has ever been supplied, but the claimants all say these mausoleum ships, despite their huge size, continued on page 94. Required to donate their bodies after death. Wow. Let's time this well. Oh, can I get him to go back onto it? That nah, doesn't really matter. Oh, yeah, double heal. Now we're maxed. <laughs> oh, that's nerve wracking. Contact energy. Anybody want to come try to get me back here? I don't think I even want to leave, to be honest. Go! Ah.
Oh, fuck. Hold on, maybe I can get it to try to come through one of these things. Come on. Come on. Is it ever gonna stop? Maybe it's not. I think I'm trapped in here. I think that might have died a while ago, actually. I just, I wasn't sure. <laughs> I wanted to be sure. Yeah, that thing's not gonna stop. Nothing? Whoa. I thought that was a creature at first. Cannons are back online. We wait. Auto targeting offline. Calibration data not found. Fuck. No auto targeting. The cannons are useless. Gotta do it manually. Manual you want to go out there with all that shit raining down and target the ADF cannons manually? If I give the cannons enough targeting data, it'll recalibrate the system. You got a better idea? Christ. I'll open exterior access. I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> No, no, no pathway? That's weird. Uh, I'm kind of lost. I think this is the right way. Yeah. Oh, hold on. I think we open that by shooting that. Yeah. Pulse rifle upgrade. I figured since we have to go outside, I probably had to go up to this hallway where, where we were at before. Because it says that goes to the exterior. And indeed, this is the right place. What's the plan? I'll seek a few of the ADS cannons to one of my tools. I target an asteroid, cannons take it out, and I recalibrate the system. We're out of options. Do it. 
Security request retrieved. Oh, God! Someone stop him! This is Second Officer Sheik. I need security here right now! No one's coming. White, for Christ's sake, step away from the controls. We need our first officer. Captain Matthias is dead. The captain's dead? Vincent's security team is dead? Who's left? Step away from the airlock. That's an order. Who's left, Sheik? A crew full of uni fanatics? Eckhart screwed us good, didn't he? If a CEC director could go that bad, maybe the whole company's rotten to the core. Just like Aegis 7. You think CEC won't send a rescue team for their precious planet cracker? Think white. We just need to hold on. Yes. You probably should. No, stop! Oh, Lord! Goddamn fool! Steal it! Do the airlock now! Here we go. Whole integrity 86%. Okay, so I probably need to be kind of fast. And I need to dodge asteroids. Sinking targeting system. Oh, it aims where I am. I see. Do I need to... Oh, A to call strike. I see. Warning. Hull integrity compromised. Calibration complete. Okay. Woo. Targeting online. somewhere where you at fuck you I'll worry about oxygen later there we go migration complete ADS recalibrated auto targeting systems enabled okay I think I'm safe now should be protected the ADS cannons are online shipwide. Thank God. Engaging autopilot. Get yourself inside, Isaac. I think I've figured out our next move. I love how often Dead Space changes things up and just has you do really cool, interesting stuff that also just totally makes sense, given the circumstances. Exiting zero gravity. Exiting vacuum. Nicole Brennan. 
Medical is a sanctuary. All survivors, please join us. Nicole, I'm going back to medical. Makes sense. I'll head to the crew deck and look for survivors from the bridge. I'll be in touch. The crew deck? Wonder if he knows something we don't. Chapter 4 completed. Chapter 5, Lethal Devotion. Yeah, that video of Nicole was pretty suspect. It looked like hastily chopped together or assembled from... Oh, okay. This is just like straight up the thing shit. God, I love it. What was I even saying? Oh yeah, the video just looked like chopped together or like... Some sort of hologram. Oh. Heck yeah. The upgraded suit that schematic yeah and I have a lot of money probably I can buy it you item available for purchase supersymmetry tether for the contact beam oh that must be an upgrade 20,000 for the suit increases your inventory inventory capacity to 22 slots and provides 10% armor yes make me shinier Even more ribs. Back ribs. Tummy ribs. Shoulder ribs. What's going on over there? episode here, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're going to go find the source of the broadcast.